Hello everybody, good evening, good evening, yeah, welcome back to this channel, this is the Ogonaya Apple Case and if this is your first time being here, thank you for coming and we want you to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell and you'll be notified of every single video that goes up on our channel, you know, it's a place to be edified. Now, this is Saturday night, 10pm GMT plus one and every time like this we come together to pray we come together to engage the force of prayer we know that prayer is the life of every believer prayer is meant to be or should be the life of the of every believer the same way that we breathe in air to live naturally you know that we are meant to take in prayer as our spiritual oxygen you know we take in prayer to live so if you must if you must um um make um get results in the realm of the spirit you must engage the force of prayer you know prayer the way the, the, same, the same way that air enters and begins to metabolize things in food in your body producing energy producing results you know you are able to walk you are able to do a lot of things because you took in oxygen not, not only because you took in food, but also because you took in oxygen. It is the same way that prayer goes in into your spirit and metabolizes the food, the word of God that you have taken in and produces results in your life. So um, tonight we are going to be praying for fruitfulness. Fruitfulness in our bodies, fruitfulness in our marriages, fruitfulness in, our, in, in the work of our hands. So we are going to be declaring and I want you to focus as you make this prayer. You know, when you come to the place of prayer, it's a time to focus on God is the time to zone in on God because without focus you are likely to miss targets in prayer you must focus in prayer in the book of Jeremiah he said that um you will seek God and you will find him if you seek with the whole of your heart you know God is not far he is near but you you find him when you are seeking with the whole of your heart because when 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 the scripture says the whole of your heart it means that you are seeking without distraction you are seeking with a lot of focus it said blessed are them that are pure in heart blessed are the pure in heart for they will see god so your ability to see god is based on the wholeness of your heart on the purity of your heart when your heart is devoid of distractions uh, devoid of um impurities devoid of distractions you are able to zone in on god and then you are able to focus and then you can experience god so your experience of god is dependent on the level of your focus little wonder ezekiel will say and i saw the angel and he measured the thousand cubits question how did he know that it was a thousand cubits it was because he was focusing on the spiritual encounter he was having he was not distracted you know a lot of us we are distracted in the place of prayer you know you are praying your, your mouth is moving you are you are um in quotes speaking in tongues but your 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 um your mind is not in what you are doing your mind is not in the prayer you are thinking about something else or you are even maybe in the midst of the prayer in the course of the prayer you are talking to another person you are asking the person ah your hair is fine oh, and all of that so that is distraction in the place of prayer but where god wants us to operate from is from the standpoint of focus where you are focused on him little wonder that jesus said you know when you want to pray enter into your closet lock the doors what he was saying was not that you cannot pray outside he was not saying that the that the closet is the only place to 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 pray he was trying to paint a picture of focus paint a picture of communion of of of, of intimacy of a one-on-one -on -one communication kind of thing so he's saying you and god you are in a one-on-one -on -one communication so he was saying enter into into your closet in your heart enter into your closet and be able to commune with god and be able to interact with your father as though he he he, he as though he were the, the 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 only one so even if you are praying in the midst of a thousand persons you are in a one-on-one -on -one communication with your father do you understand so that's what jesus was saying so as we pray tonight i want your heart i want your heart to be focused on what you are doing i don't want you to be distracted i want you to zone in on god tonight i want you to cast your tally i want you to cast your focus upon the father oh upon him that is seated upon the throne can you begin to lift up your voice and begin to lift up your heart 
heart even as you worship the father this this night as you see him seated upon the throne magnify the name of the lord bow in worship bow in reverence and we have come to the god that answers prayer we have come to the mighty god we have come to the one that has all dominion he is the king of all kings he is the lord of all lords he is the mighty redeemer he is the one that was that is and is to come he is the one that opened the door and no man can shut her he is the one he shut a door no man can open he is the lion of the tribe of judah he is the one that rules and reigns even in the affairs of men he has the heart of kings in his hands and he directs them like the course of the waters oh the earth is the lord's and the fullness thereof the world and all that dwell therein lord we worship you we magnify your name tonight we call you yeshua we call you yeshua you are the living God. You are the living word. You are the one that has sustained us. You are the one that has kept us. You are the one that has protected and provided for us. It is in you we live. In you we move. In you we have our being. You are the essence of our lives. Can you just go ahead? Go ahead and lift up your voice tonight. Go ahead and lift up the sacrifice of your worship tonight. We have come to Elohim. We have come to Adonai. We have come to the rich monarch of zion can you behold the lion and the lamb that is seated upon the throne oh can you behold um, the mighty man in battle can you behold the warrior oh Jenamaha, resunde gedaha the lord of hosts is his name can you behold the rider upon the white horse and the one that is the accused judgment upon the nations oh jenananton malanda resunze predorabalata and the maguas in the penagua resuse gepenia can you just allow your heart Hot to magnify the Lord tonight. Um, let your heart magnify the Lord. Uh, remember the, 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 the deeds of the Lord. Uh, remember the mighty works of the Lord in your life, uh, in your family, um, in your marriage, uh, in your academics, uh, in your business, in the work of your hands. Uh, can you say, Lord, I thank you. Uh, Lord, you have sustained me. Uh, I remember how you saved me from that accident. Uh, Lord, I thank you. Uh, I give you the praise. Uh, my heart is exceedingly glad. Uh, oh, Jesus, I worship. Uh, rest Sai no manantan de sombre tu rabanata En kepe no si le vretaha Recopre de falataha There is none to be compared with you Oh you are incomparable You are the incomparable God You are the all knowing You are the only wise God You are the one that dwell In the lights There is no shadow in your turning There is no variability in you You are God all by yourself Oh je gadan tonomaha Resuse gebentos kabala e resune gadia dolo baram de ruse velete en goala sun de bre de regaba ragada da 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 nu siete en shana mantons de beha regadon sani maram de rubeleta en en nonza ha we have come to you ha yeshua ha mashiah recompre tesa namaha reteno manata ha lesuna kali ha you are jesus our savior and we thank you. Uh, we give you the praise. Uh, we give you the glory. Uh, Jesus, we thank you. Be thou exalted, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we have worshipped. Amen. We'll be taking our anchor scripture from the book of Psalm chapter 112. We'll be reading from verse 1 to verse um to verse 3. So we'll be drawing two prayer points from it. First of all, is the fruitfulness of our body. The next one is the fruitfulness of the work of our hands. The works of our hands. So, um, Psalms chapter 112 from verse 1. It says, Praise ye the Lord. Blessed is the man that feared the Lord, that delighted greatly in his commandments. Okay, we'll start from this prayer point. Now, it says, Praise the Lord. Blessed is the man that feared the Lord, number one that delighted greatly in his commandments so this is the prerequisite to the blessedness that 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 is going to come in the subsequent verses so it is that the man fears the lord and then that he delights in his commandments so we're going to be making a simple prayer lord help us king of glory to to have this let your spirit of fear in the book of isaiah chapter 11 they, they're talking about the seven spirits of the lord there is one spirit that is called the spirit of the fear of the lord can you say holy ghost let the spirit of the fear of the lord come 
come upon me in the name of Jesus. Let me let my dealings, my dealings in life be from the standpoint of reverence for the Father, of the fear of the Lord. Ziga, the fear of the Lord will prevent you to from doing certain things in your life. Uh, can you say, Lord, Barasie or Son of Veleta, Resuse Gepelaha, Jekan Deluria, Seso Pretenama, Resunia? I present myself to you, uh, Lord, that you will sit upon me, uh, oh Jekada, and place the spirit of 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 uh, 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 of the fear of the Lord in my heart uh, in the name of Jesus uh, that my dealings uh, will come uh, from the standpoint of the fear of the Lord uh, in the name of Jesus uh, the coordinate the boundaries of my living uh, the boundaries of my speaking uh, the boundaries of my actions uh, will be uh, will be by, by the spirit of the fear of the Lord in the name of Jesus oh Jiganananto Nebeleta Resune Kebelena Rosela Manata Jekedegeteha that I will delight greatly in your commandments uh. oh lord mary son uh, i will love your commandments uh, oh i will love your ways uh, i will go in your path uh. i will go in the in the, in the path that you have set uh, in the name of jesus uh. resune melata may i not love iniquity oh he says how jesus uh, he said oh je ne me ne pas. he said he loved righteousness and hated iniquity therefore god uh, has highly exalted him. Uh, oh, God has given him an oil of gladness uh, above his contemporaries. Uh, can you say, Lord, may I love righteousness. Uh, may I love your commandments. Uh, may I hate iniquity in the name of Jesus. Uh, my life uh, will flow in line with your commandments uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, rid me of every evil. Rid me of every iniquity. Rid me of every addiction uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, parasilo tomarandeha, let the spirit of God sit upon my life. Uh, the purifying fire. Let it flow through my life. Uh, purify my actions. Uh, purify my thoughts. Uh, resole gobaha and sudo beletengaha. Ragadadayan sune peleta. Purify my actions, oh God. In the name of Jesus, we have prayed. Uh, we have prayed. Uh, amen. Now, verse 2 it says, He says, His seed shall be mighty upon earth. The generation of the upright shall be blessed. So he's saying that the seed of the righteous will be mighty upon the earth. So the scripture is not is not even the, the scripture has gone beyond the the argument of if the, the the righteous will have seed or not. The scripture has gone beyond if the righteous will be fruitful in the womb or not. The scripture has gone beyond ah will the righteous be barren will they be able to to produce he, 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 he the, the the concern of the scripture is that the seed of the righteous it means that the righteous has been destined to be fruitful it means that the righteous has not has not been destined to be barren has not been destined to you know you know you know not to be productive and not to bear children because in the beginning god spoke to man and said multiply he said he blessed man and say to him be fruitful and multiply he was telling him have children be fruitful replenish the earth let you let the earth be filled out with your children so the the, the 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 word of the lord has gone forth that the righteous will bear precious seed and the righteous will bear seed what the scripture is now saying is that the seed of the righteous will be mighty upon the earth so it means that fruitfulness is the will of the father so we are going to be declaring over every in quote barren situations over a, 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 every 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 um, orchestration of darkness in the lives of believers in the lives of those that are the righteousness of god and we are going to be enacting the law of god we are going to be saying yes we open up their wombs yes we open up their wombs and we we'll declare that they will be fruitful in the land and then that their seed will be mighty upon the earth can you just go ahead and begin to declare in the name of jesus uh, there is fruitfulness kappa in sodo beleta receive Suse and Kuala Gande, Jekos in the Maha, Reseno Baratia, Resole Kada, Jetene Manana. If you have points of contact, can you begin to have them in your mind? 
couples, uh, marriages, uh, homes, uh, uh, that are seeking for the fruit, for the, 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 the fruit of the womb. Uh, have them in mind as you make these declarations. Uh, according to the word of the Lord, uh, you are fruitful in the body. In the name of Jesus, uh, I open up the the, 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 the womb. Uh, oh, Shekai no Sonoma, uh, I call for the children in your lungs. Uh, come forth, uh, come forth. Uh, Resila Bakwana and Sino Pedos and Sia Toveleta Resus Gedena and Sonoma Mama Antos Igibideha Recomblena. They are children in your loins in Scanema Resina Malata. Comfort, comfort, comfort. I pull you out of the loins Resina Malata into the natural realm of existence. Aquantes Cobalata. I pull you out of the spirit realm into the natural. Rasaina mana languantes kama Rasaina baba baba Rasaina baba baba antos amana Rasaina manata Jekoto koto belata Whatsoever is the barrier I pull it down now Rasana manda I dissolve it by the blood of the Lama, with the blood of the Lama, Rasta Benesta Berunska Balata, Jeketeketeketa, and Sotoba Baba Baha, Resana Manana, Dakwa Sedoba, Rasena Baba Baba, Jeketeketeka Baha, Rasano Manande, Leko Barasiete, and Sando Banguata, Rasaina Balada, E Jagadagada Baba Baha. Oh, all through the scripture, all through the scripture is only, uh, um, what was her name again? Is it uh, Mitchell now? The um, the the daughter of King Saul that really called King David when he was dancing. It all through the scripture, it was only her that was regarded. That was that was that that is known to have been buried throughout. People that started out not having children, God remembered them. God, God came to them and they bore children. Sarah, in her old age, bore children. Um, Rachel bore children. Uh, 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 Elizabeth bore children. So all through the, the scripture, we, we see the faithfulness of God in the area of childbearing because it is his mandate, it is his will, it is his, the, the, the first command he gave man, the first word he spoke be, was be fruitful. So it, it, it's a vital part of God that man is fruitful. So we are declaring one more time. In the name of Chi oh, Shakanama, we are going to be echoing the word of God. Be fruitful. In the name of Jesus, be fruitful. In the name of Jesus, be fruitful. In the name of Jesus, thou womb, be fruitful. In the name of Jesus, the the the, the systems uh, involved in reproduction, be fruitful in the man, be fruitful in the woman, be fruitful in the name of Jesus. I bind the spirit of barrenness uh, and I declare to your body. Be fruitful in Kade Resusie e Gunteha Masieto Riazieto Rekedus en Kabalane Manesuse e Kanantosia. Be fruitful in the name of Jesus. Be fruitful by the mercies of the Lord. Be fruitful by the mercies of the Lord. Be fruitful by the mercies of the Lord. Be fruitful. Shani mante shania legadia sune menenga biya hajede belete na vene mene kai na malanda hajede beleta rese no vene mene yagi mene vende belete iye nje vende bedi belete ika ye no no maladi vende beleta rese zo vele ni meji ana mande zunde pre no rava da giye to mana na giye ando zo ve rasunzi vini a de belete ve shai na mata oh yes 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 thank you father thank you father thank you father thank you father 
Thank you, Father. Haha. Shana Mantosia. Thank you, Father. Libarasiete. Lequana Mandesia. Resuse Veletia. Thank you, Father. Gina Mamaha. And Soko Bentene Maha. Resone Balata. The cry of the baby. Jegadon Celebre and Togombaha. Resilo Ventegepaha. And Sana Manaha. Your baby. Jeka and Sonto Beris Evina Esulia Recade Ros in Seletania Melangia Gagande Rusevele. Rasiete Nenia Nozivele Tagayan Gobelete Rain Sonomara Getonzi Valania in the name of Jesus. The 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 months of pregnancy the Lord will see you through. The moments of delivery the Lord will see you through. In the name of Jesus we have prayed. Amen and amen. So finally we're praying from verse from verse three he said wealth and riches shall be in his house and his righteousness endure it forever wealth and riches shall be in his house so we are going to be declaring over the works of our hands in the name of jesus that the old jacquard the lord places his blessings upon the works of our hands to bring in wealth and riches into our house because the mandate of god is that wealth and riches will be in our house not just anyhow money he says wealth wealth and riches so there is a dimension of wealth that god wants us to have as his righteous people and that's what we are going to be praying for he says wealth and riches wealth and riches and and most of the times it is through the works of our hands that god brings in this dimension of prosperity so we are going to be praying it says in the book of deuteronomy chapter 8 verse 18 he says, for it is the lord by god that give it the power to make wealth we are going to be praying for the power to make wealth to be bestowed upon us tonight in the name of jesus go ahead because and as you are making this prayer let it not be that the reason you are you are praying for finances is just to consume it upon your loss the scripture says that thy kingdom the kingdom will be we we expand through prosperity say through prosperity the the kingdom will expand the cities will expand the city of god will expand so we are going to be making this prayer from the standpoint of kingdom mindedness kingdom mindedness kingdom mindedness in the name of jesus we are saying lord bless us increase us for the sake of the kingdom commit massive wealth into our hands ah for kingdom purpose in the name of jesus the power to make wealth is bestowed upon us tonight in the name of jesus we are fruitful in the works of our hands we are fruitful in the works of our hands in in the name of Jesus, Kamamante Resule Egane Jekuteleba Resenovela Inkube Gaino Esilete Ragandenojeha Lesi Sunemana. Let my abode be filled with wealth and with riches. In the name of Jesus, Mendenojeha, I bind the spirit of poverty. I bind the spirit of lack in the name of Jesus, the spirit of insufficiency. You will not, your operations will not be played out in my life. Uh, in the name of Jesus, Resaina Mamateha, Legande Sainamaha, Ragadante no Meneha, Jegedeilaha, Erusene Mante, Ragade no Sebele no Camele de Guaninga de Sonomaram de Rivaha, Rani no Velene Majen de Belecaha, Erusivelia no Manaman de Gediata, Enomana Nananana. Let ideas begin to drop into our bosom. In the name of Jesus, we have the mind of Christ. Therefore, we think like Christ. Ideas come to us. Supernatural ideas. Ideas that will bring our breakthroughs. In the name of Jesus. Ideas that will bring us into our world of place. In the name of Jesus, we receive inspiration from the Spirit of the Lord. We receive ideas. Manasia, wisdom. And the blessedness of the kingdom, the blessings of the Lord upon our finances, upon the works of our hands. 
spirit receiver in the name of Jesus. Oh, Can you just um, um stretch forth your hand um in the manner of receiving as I pray for you tonight? In the name of Jesus, I place upon your hands the key to your prosperity. In the name of Jesus, I place in your hands tonight the key to your prosperity. In the name of Jesus, I place in your hands tonight the key to your prosperity. In the name of Jesus, Kabante Siso Feletande Shigadade Zonovente Jika Paru Severia Teila Mananande Shakata in sono mangen de non si ve no mende ge de jeru se ve la ha resun se ve ne gande be no jenga na na no si varata the spirit of of the living god begins to oh she be the power begins to move in your life in the aspect of prosperity and releases to you all that you need to prosper I <laughs> got the door by virtue of the key that has been released to you. It may be in form of an idea. It may be in form of something that is peculiar to your destiny that you will do, and it will launch you into your wealthy place. In the name of Jesus, you walk in through that door. That door is opened unto you in the name of Jesus. I declare that the Lord sends men your way, helpers of destiny, shepherds and principal men that would help you in the name of Jesus. Men of valor, men of courage, loyal men in the name of Jesus. Father Lord, we thank you. We give you all the praise. In the name of Jesus, we have prayed. Amen and amen. Thank you very much for joining in tonight. Um, I want to um, bring to your notice every Monday morning we have what um, God put in our hearts to um, to do. We uh, we have called it Monday morning confession. So these are declarations that we expect you to speak over your life every week. And you can take that confession and make it a daily declaration over your life before you leave your house you confess those words you know our words make our words the words that will speak frame our 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 experiences so do where to join in every monday morning 6 30 a.m on this same channel 6 30 a.m gmt plus one this same channel thank you very much god bless you and do have a wonderful night rest bye mm-hmm.